Hello everyone, and we're doing an episode of my game of UWO, Uncharted Waters, because we are doing a handful of things today. Those things, nothing crazy, but you get an idea of what I'm up to, doing some more management grind, <clears throat> as well as um, going to do some shipbuilding today for one of my tunes. So, one of the first things we have to do is just quickly sell off this stuff. So what I need to do is I need to check up on the shipyard. And then my other tune. And what is he up to? He's just waiting over here. <clears throat> I want to see if my other tune is finished building the ship that he started building. So I could sell it off and then we can get what we need to do some modifications. So that's what really this episode is going to be about is modifying a ship for my other tune. Uh, I don't know what I want to do necessarily just yet, but let's do some shopping around and see what sort of things we can get done. Ship is done, perfect. So we're going to sell this Explorer Carrick. Alright, so let's, let's take a look at some... One of the things I'd like to also do for my ship is I'd like to also modify my own ship here to get some more wave resistance here on this guy. And I know wave resistance, I believe, is resulted on anti-fouling paint. Let me just double check. It is not. Okay, uh, what am I thinking of? Traverse ropes. Yeah, traverse ropes, I think. Yeah, that improves wave resistance, and I need 10 million for that. Do I have any traverse ropes in my inventory? Not that I see here. Let's go just check the bank to make sure. Because I'd like to do some ship improvements, and one of them being wave resistance. <clears throat> now, I don't know what it's going to take to do that exactly, but we're going to take a look. Because I'm not a professional with building ships. And I'm going to show you guys my learning process. Do I have any traverse ropes? Not in here. Something to put away, though. And anything in quarter storage. It doesn't appear so. No. Okay. So, before we do that, let's go back to the shipyard and see about ship improvements to our current ship. <clears throat> What's it going to take? And how do we do those? So, custom shipbuilding. Oh, you know what? We won't be able to do anything with our ship if... Well, we could at least play around with this. So, ship skill reset. No, we don't need to do that. So, like, that's got good wave resistance. I want to increase the wave resistance of my cargo duction. Cargo duction. Yeah, like, because I do production with that skill. With that ship. So, let's see. What's it going to take to do ship improvements? I need an SSIP. I need six. Ah. I gotta buy SSIPs. Okay. So let's go change to the chat settings here. Well, chat settings, merchant chat. I want to buy SSIPs. PM. For your other I don't think that's something I can get. I'm 
improve turn speed. Do I need that too? I guess I could. It's not that important to me. Because I only have three SSIPs. says I got six. So what? What the fudge? So can I not? Well, let's get these traverse rooms real quick. change ships real quick. And then let's do custom ship building. And let's see what it takes to do that. So it's going to take three. What if I bought another traverse rope? Just curious. Two at once. Oops. So I want to build a ship. I want to modify one. Again, it doubles it up. And it's only going to cost 326, 204,000. And three ship building permits. Okay. SSIPs I do have. I'd like to buy more, and yes, this absolutely would. Max capacity, current capacity, 696. No penalty to already have the maximum that I could do. And this will incur, reduce its turn speed, maybe? No, it seems to be fine. Okay, so we can get some... Carduction, what can we call it? Carduction. an improvement of production so that's going to take some time 16 days specifically 16 days at sea that'll be nice to have that with a little bit more wave resistance so we need to go spend 16 days at sea so what we've been doing has been going back and forth between Palma and Seville. <clears throat> so that's kind of like all we're really been up to. Let's just make sure that the ship we're in has, yep, does have a workshop. So we are good to do what we need to do. Um, put our ship parts back on. go to Palma. I need to get some long ship voyaging in too for my research because that's something that has to be done too. That's the one thing about this game is I am constantly managing what it is I need to be doing and sometimes things just don't marry up. Like what I'm trying to do here is get long range voyaging but also try to grind my management skill. So I gotta go pick up some things and management grinding just takes like a second between places. So it's whatever. Now that my other tune like I said, he needs a ship information uh, switch here because he wants his first clipper to be given a, um, a skill. Um, I don't think it has to be emergency acceleration, but it would be nice if it was. But this is my fast ship right now, and if I can get my clipper improved even further, you know, that would be great. Um, but... 
So this is my production ship. This is a ship that was given to me. I kind of like it, but it's not my favorite. It's a good little quick sh ship that I'd like to hold on to. But I'd like to modify this clipper to have more wave resistance. This has so much more wave resistance. I, like I, I feel like I f shouldn't do much with this ship other than give it a basic production skill thing because I do a lot of production. Like I don't need high lookout, I don't need galley, I just need like basic, uh, I should probably just keep the galley. That would be fine. Because this guy doesn't do anything for me other than be an aid ship. And this guy is literally for traveling long distances quickly. So, I already have a production ship, which is this one, but I guess I could make this like a, I don't know. I don't know what to do with it. I just like it. Production ship. If I could reproduce this ship into this one, where it's got a good amount of... I don't know. You guys tell me what I should do with this clipper. It's got a blank slate. No improvements done on it. You know, things I could probably do to it. Things I could wait. You know, I don't have a max rank uh, shipbuilder over there. He can't do maximum amount of stuff, but he can do a few things. So give me some ideas what you think I maybe should do with this clipper. Or what I should do with this honey pot. I mean, this cruise light clipper. clipper. Um, you know, it's got one improvement done to it. Probably to give it more wave resistance and stuff. But, you know, if you think there's something I could do with it, yeah, maybe we could figure something out. Either one of these two. Give me ideas. Sell one, keep one, you name it. Don't want to go nuts doing major work with it. But otherwise, this tune is working on uh, research as well, and it's production researches. So we are just going to continue to grind that production research stuff by traveling to some of our more local production chains that we do. We do a lot of ham production um, and pork production just to grind production. So that's what we're going to do. <coughs> Going to Pharaoh. <coughs> Excuse me. Going to Pharaoh is pretty close. So we will do that. I keep forgetting that I could be using the rowing skill here. Oh no, I can't now, because I'm on my rowing ship. Duh. That's the one that I'm working on improving. So I need 18 minutes to do that. So that's what I've been up to. Um, I've been away. Guys, if you want to know why I've been away from recording and posting, it's primarily because I am in the process of buying a house, and that should be, I say quote-unquote, could be done by Wednesday of this week. And today is Sunday, Mother's Day. So should everything go as planned, I could be out of here. Well, I won't have to be forced out, but I will be moving into my new place starting Wednesday, and that'll take me some time um, to do, and I'll probably be um, online less, which I was already online less for the last two weeks because of a mini vacation, as well as also um, the housing stuff getting really busy. So right now I am focusing on just getting to that closing date so that I can finally start moving things. And one of the first and foremost things I want to move is just all the non-important stuff. So that's going to take such a long time that I don't expect to have my rig and everything moved over all that soon. So it'll be a while before I am fully ready to move back into the new home. But before that happens, I guess we could change out of... The world chat settings of okay. Well, we had the wine. I didn't do anything with it, but that's okay. Get the olives. Get the almonds. And right now, celery is a rare trade good, I believe. I could be wrong. It might have changed. I'm pretty sure it still is. Uh, yeah, go back to Seville and 
this is what we're doing back and forth until we hit 18 minutes. I didn't really pay attention how long that took us to do that last one, but... We're doing everything we can here. We'll eat some more bagels. At least till the bagels run out. Easy. Now for the nuts. Okay. And now for the wine, turning it into vinegar. Need more vigor. said <clears throat> we're really grinding our management and navigation is kind of the important thing actually navigation really boosts when we are or the navigation really boosts when we travel long distance so we really need to get to there how close are we to getting there for our other ships it's eight we need to get to for the other ship yeah, so we're, we're almost there. We gotta do some long trips. But we'll do some long trips after we finish building this ship. Actually, you know what? Maybe after this we'll just go take a quick, a quote-unquote quick long trip to, um, take a long trip to London. I think that'd be not so bad. Obviously been at Vero a while for this tune. Let's get those pigs. Uh, we don't need to do anything with that yet, but we do need to get pigs. So we can convert them. Actually, let's just go ahead and sell them. Let's go ahead and sell the... Uh, the ham. And if we're gonna do this, we might as well sail back and forth between the two places that sell pork and ham. Really close, because it's Sagers. They sell pigs too. But we need to do this quick. Use up all the broad bean and ham soup that I made earlier. So close. But we're back at Sager's. We'll sell the ham we made. Selling furniture? No, you're not. Storage barrels for storing food and etc. I don't need to store trade goods. But let's do it. Where are SMPs? Oh. Duh. I don't ever look at the. Hmm. That's something we should be doing with the other two. I'm just going back and forth and doing the wine part. I think that would make life a lot easier. Oh, and getting the iron too. Be a lot easier. Of 
question. Maybe we can go to the bank real quick here. And put our furniture in. Seville for this because we'd like to see if we can put that furniture in our quarters. Switch the piggies over. there all right now I do nutritional recipes and we should be able to do nope we're supposed to we need to do makeable meats there it is all right and then <coughs> we make up our soup and we eat the soup and that's the cycle oh we're so close back already we know we're not done here so let's just go ahead and sell here just keep buying the wine come on to Sagers. It's not the longest trip and doesn't give me a ton of experience in the other direction, but whatever. See if we can set our furniture while we're there. I didn't move any of my shit parts over for this guy. Okay, here we are at the quarters. Let's see if we can do furniture setting here. goods that we could store here. Okay, that is now set in place. And now to go back to getting some ham done. All I have to do is produce like one thing, so let's just go to get it to Pharaoh. Iron. 
sell the wine vinegar. And then we come back over here. And go back to Seville with the three days of food we have left. And plop it down. And do vinegar again. And we do metallurgy. And we do iron, since that's what we just picked up. And then we stock up on our food again. And back over. So this is getting, this is what I do, guys. It, it back and forth all day until you get the thing you need. It is a grind. All right, so we're gonna sell off. No, we don't have to sell off anything. We need to buy. This is another thing. I'm confused about what I need. All right, buy our pigs. And we just gotta go convert them to ham. Then make. to ham. Be sure this is completed. Make the ham. Use the rest of our get stocked back up. Make the last of our ham and then make the rest of the soup. much but plenty and then that should be it finished with our ship too while we're at it. I doubt it, but I think we're about done with Charles Thunder today because we just need to go hand in our thesis and we are checking to see if this is finished apologize for the sound that was the sound of my drawstring of my pants hitting the desk two more days at sea so let's go finish that up two more days at sea easy enough go fill up on our food while we're at it. Oops. I'll just sit at port. I'll use our skills. Two minutes and then we'll hand in this. Research is done. How are we doing with our college skills? We have three skills. Production. All right, so we got a lot of things there. Let's see, what else, what else can we research? Now we're in the third stage of college.
Normal voyaging, epic feud contributions, perform imperial quest, and national colonial development. Yeah, I don't do those things. Profitable trade, get rich, or and trade. That's going to take longer. So let's do the normal voyaging part. Because then what I can do is I can use this to go get the Namban stuff or go get the spice. Come back. Hopefully that'll finish this. And then we'll be able to use this to get the rich trade part. So I'll do this one. Well, while we're at it. Since he's pretty much not doing anything else for us, let's make sure he's prepared to go on a nice long voyage. What ships do we have and what ships do we want to use? <clears throat> We're not going to need to use the ship, so let's go ahead and change our ship. To our aid cab. Load you up with food and water for a nice long trip. We could go get spices or we could go to the Caribbean. The Caribbean might be fun since it's been a while since we've done that. Let's change our ship parts over. we could auto nav it but we won't we will just set sail ourselves and head west and see where we hit oops we don't have enough sailors we need to get more sailors that's ah, important the acceleration and see where they end up um, well you guys should be two minutes or up yep we'll go back into town oops I clicked the wrong one I do this a lot I'm rushing Port Harbor go back to the shipyard and see how that ship came out but extra wave resistance that way maybe I can make some longer voyages with you Ship information, let's look at my ship inventory. And yep, now I have a ship with four wave resistance instead of what two? <laughs> so that's really not I wasted 10 million, 20 million actually to get four wave resistance. That's really freaking great. Goes to show you when you don't have the uh I wasted so much money for that. So much money. Lesson learned, everybody. Make sure you have a higher shipbuilding skill before you do things like this, because if you don't, you will have failures like this, where you waste an improvement on getting, what, two extra wave resistance? I should have remembered what I was at before. I'll look at the video, and we'll see. But if that's really what I got, yeah, two wave resistance. Yep, I went up two on my wave resistance with a maximum value of seven that I could get. Am I going to waste another 10 million and three SSIPs in order to do this? I think not. We'll see how many SSIPs I have left. Yeah. I'm going to waste another three SSIPs for that. Yeah, no thanks. So, we learned a lesson. A very hard and expensive lesson. You want to improve ships? By all means, do so. At a cost. And it takes three shipbuilding permits to do those kinds of improvements. Yeah, you get a plus five to plus 15 potentially. What does traverse ropes get you? But plus one to plus 
yeah, to plus three. So I guess I did get the low end of it. And that's why I did two, so you don't get much. I should have seen that as a potential. Could have totally seen that coming. But I did get what I asked for, which was more wave resistance. Do your research, people. Make sure that you're seeing what you can get out of that, because that is, that is bad. And building the ships myself could potentially result in more wave resistance, right? Like, can I build a ship with better wave resistance at the wrong ship? Like, right out the gate? Maybe not from this location, but... Yeah, we don't do rowing ships here. But let's build a ship over here. BTC. Something that doesn't take me too long. Build. 16 days. Let's build that. Call you a cell. We'll change our own ship. We'll change it to the Carduction. Because we want to. And let's go get some money. So we're not empty handed. So we're traveling to a place that we can then maybe build another row ship. So we're going to sail to Alexandria, I think, or Cairo. Let's see if we can get into a place like that. Actually, I know where we're going to go. Well, let's try. Let's get some money. And we are going to sail. Also need to change all of our ship parts. So we can go to Tunis. We could go all the way to Alexandria or Cairo. Well, it's an allied country, but we we'll still need. Stop at Tunis first. Let's see how you're doing. Your deck is getting dirty. How dare your deck get dirty. We're still in the Strait of Gibraltar? Oh no, no, I was going to say, we're in the North Atlantic Ocean. We are pretty much now at that standstill. So, everybody, I do hope that you enjoyed watching this episode with me. I am going to continue to grind my shipbuilding skill so that I can actually do things that are worthwhile with ships like these because I usually like faster ships, but I feel like this ship is a cool-looking ship, and I like to get things like this more with my with this tune, at least. And I want to build ships like this with better skills and all that, so we are just grinding away on it while we can. Today's the last day of 100% boost day. Um, so, 
Oh, no, we don't want to quit. So it's our last day that we're going to be able to do this. Um, and because of that, we are not going to come back for a little while because we only do things when things are on boosts because that's a waste of our time. So, yeah. And while we are doing... This might trigger our research for long voyages, so we hope so. And that'll be it for this episode because we are going to dock... Um, in these uh, two places and see you next time all right guys take it easy it's been great chuck thunder be sure to like and subscribe as always bye bye